Hey there curious minds, welcome back to our channel and today we are diving into a topic that's both surprising and slightly unsettling. Cysticercosis, commonly known as brain worms. This is the med surge and we are about to embark on a journey deep into the intricate world of parasitic infections that can affect our brain. But don't worry, we'll keep it engaging and informative. So hit that subscribe button and let's get started. So what exactly is cysticercosis? Well, imagine this. Microscopic invaders setting up a camp in your brain, disrupting your nervous system like unwanted guests crashing a party. We don't want that happening, right? Cysticercosis is caused by the larva of the pork tape worm, also known as tinea solia. These larva, called cysticerci, can take residence not only in your muscles, but also in your brain and spinal cord. Now imagine your brain is a cake, not a real one of course. The cysticerci are like the sneaky sugar hungry gremlins that decide your brain cake looks like a very cozy place to stay. They attach to the brain tissue and can cause all sorts of symptoms like headache, seizures and even more severe neurological problems. But hold on, how do these brain worms even get in there in the first place? Well, it all starts with consuming undercooked pork infected with the tapeworm's eggs. Once these eggs find their way into your digestive system, they hatch and the larva travel through your bloodstream to various parts of your body, including, you guessed it right, your brain. Cysticercosis is often more prevalent in regions with poor sanitation and hygiene practices. But fear not, prevention is key. Cooking pork to the right temperature, practicing good hand hygiene and proper sanitation can significantly reduce the risk of contracting these unwelcoming guests. Alright, it's quiz time. Can you guess which country has the highest rate of cysticercosis? Leave your answer in the comments below. I'll reveal the correct answer at the end of this video. Remember, knowledge is power and by learning about these unusual topics, we can better protect ourselves and others. So the next time someone brings up the topic of brain worms at a dinner party, you'll be armed with these facts. Thank you so much for joining on this brain tickling adventure into the world of cysticercosis. And if you found this video both intriguing and slightly creepy, give us a thumbs up and share it with your fellow adventurers. And now for the moment of truth, the country with the highest rate of cysticercosis is revealed in the comments. Stay curious, stay informed and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.